a director of your company, you have three main day-to-day -day duties, of which we've made it as easy as possible to maintain. One, create a sales invoice. Everyone likes to be paid. Two, upload a bank statement. Three, enter in any expense that you've paid for on behalf of the company. So, here we go. Our online bookkeeping system is simple to use. Here are a few quick pointers to get you started. When you first log into your online account, you'll be taken to the dashboard. Here you'll find a general overview of your business. You will also find your tax timeline, which gives you real-time updates of any payment or submissions due. To raise a sales invoice, hover your cursor over the Work tab on the dashboard and select Invoicing. On the right-hand side, you will see the Add New Invoice button. Press the button and enter the relevant details onto the invoice. Then press Create New Invoice. This will produce a draft invoice where you can add the invoice details. Select Add Invoice Item and enter the correct hours and rate. If you are VAT registered, remember to select the standard VAT rate and then click Create Invoice. This will then show the invoice as it will be received. Check through all the details and if they are correct, you are ready to mark as sent. And it's done. To upload a bank statement, click the Banking tab on the dashboard. On the new page, you'll see the Upload Statement button. You'll then need to select the correct account and then the correct file to upload. Expenses that have been paid out of your own pocket, not the company's, will need to be input into the system. These will automatically tally up, so you know exactly what is owed to you. To add an expense, hover your cursor over the My Money tab and select Expenses, then Add New Expense. Here you can add the details of the expense and a small description. This helps us so that if the expense is in the wrong department, we'll know where to reassign it. Then click Create New Expense and you're done. To be able to send your invoices directly from the online system by email, you can add new contacts in the Contacts tab. You can also link these contacts to projects so that when you're invoicing for a project, the system will know who to send them to.